um, that just let me know I can just fight through adversity and be able to just produce at the uh, in the college level and make two big time plays. Hey, Lamichael, what's the best part of your game? Um, me being able to catch the ball, um, my quick decision making uh, at the line of scrimmage, and I feel like uh, my vision, my footwork, honestly. Did, did they have patterns where you had to read the defense coming out of the backfield? Or? Uh, most definitely. Um, I know what the defense is doing before the play even starts, so uh, I feel like that always helps me out, uh, just knowing what's in front of me um, and just knowing what I'm going against. Right. Uh, I feel like it's very big because, um, I mean, you can't just be one dimensional in this game. Uh, you got to be a guy who's able to do everything, and uh, I feel like that's one of my biggest traits. Uh, I'm not just a one-dimensional guy. I'm able to catch the ball, uh, pass, protect, just everything the NFL wants these days. So uh, I feel like I can contribute very early. What has Gainesville taught you? Um, just to compete for real, man. Um, it's a loving city. Uh, everybody's for the Gators. So uh, that's the first thing I wanted when I came down there, man, just to be able to play football for the Gators. Uh, that was one of my biggest things. Uh, I came down there on a seven-hour bus trip to earn an offer, so... Uh, I mean, it was just an amazing feeling to be able to uh, produce for four years in a great program. Uh, Coach Muller had something going, man, just being able to uh, come back off two double-digit win seasons, uh, two New Year's Six Bowls. Uh, so he, he got things going and rolling down there, man. It's a great feeling down there, honestly. Hey, what if would you your miss health most was about? a tire, what kind of tire would you be? If, say that again? Oh, I mean, the, your health, your carries. Would you be a Pirelli tire or a Bridgestone? Uh, I feel like I have under 500 carries in my career, so uh, I'm not a guy who's injury prone. Um, I'm a very healthy guy, so uh, I feel like uh, that's going to help me at the next level just not being able to take that much beating in, uh, in the SEC. Hey, what will you miss most about playing for your coach? Um, I mean, just the love that he has for his players and um, just uh, the competition he has every day, day in and day out. Uh, he prepared me to, for this next level. Uh, being um, ready for the NFL, and so I feel like um, Florida, that's one of the best schools in the nation to go to if you want to try and get ready for the NFL. Can you, can you talk about your senior experience? Um, just amazing being back at home, uh, being able to compete in front of my hometown crowd, uh, being able to compete some of the best seniors uh, around the country. Uh, and just uh, just amazing feeling to uh, be able to show off my talents, honestly. Um, honestly, man, you just, um, it's not, you just got to understand that the value is going down, but, um, understand, like, um, it's nothing that, uh, teams hold against you. It's just, um, they have a high value for other pl uh, players and other, uh, other options or uh, positions. So, I mean, I'm, it doesn't hurt me at all. I just come out and compete and do what I got to do to uh, make a team, honestly. Although you don't have the preference, would you like to play East Coast, West Coast in the snow or stay in Florida? Um, I mean, if I was able to stay in Florida, that would be a nice feeling as well. But um, any team who's giving me opportunity, I'm, uh, I'm going to go anywhere. It doesn't matter to me for real. What's your favorite formation to run out of? Uh, shotgun, yeah. Really? Uh, backfield shotgun or wing? Or in other words, if you're put uh, on... Backfield shotgun. What about jet sweep? Uh, I can do jet sweeps as well. Yeah, it doesn't matter. Is there a scheme that you really like inside zone, outside zone, gap out? Um, I mean, being um, at Florida for four years, uh, for two of those years I was in a pro style offense. Uh, the last two I was in the spread, so uh, I pretty much know how to run any offense you throw at me. So uh, I can run outside zone, inside zone, power, toss plays. It don't matter. Have you met with the Bucks yet? Uh, yeah, I met with the Buccaneers and the senior bowl. Yeah. What was that meeting like? Uh, they really liked me. Um, I mean, they said they need some running backs down there in Tampa. So, uh, I mean, yo, I wouldn't mind them taking me at all. Hey, what kind of... Uh um, I, I mean, like I said, there's not pretty many guys that can be able to catch the ball in the backfield and things like that. So, I feel like um, if you find some of those three down backs, um, like Josh Jacobs and Saquon Barkley, the guys that are able to go first round, um, find a higher value in those guys. So I feel like that's why I'm uh, one of the best guys in the draft for uh, for the BF value. Back. Hey, a little different question. Describe a Florida play. What what does it sound like? What in the huddle? Yeah. Like Florida play in the huddle. What does the quarterback say? I want to get a sense of your terminology. Um, pretty much, uh, we don't run. We run no huddle. So uh, all our calls come from the sidelines. Oh, okay. We run, uh, we got signals for everything. Yeah, so you have to actually get used to saying like uh, uh, toss 38, halfback, sweep, something like that, right? Uh, pretty much, yeah. yeah. Interesting. What was it like for Coach Knox? Coach Knox, man, uh, when he first came in, man, it was crazy because uh, he came in and pretty much was just telling us like, if you're not learning the ins and outs of our offense, um, 
uh, I'm cheating you. So pretty much, man, he had me uh, focused on just uh, just learning how to be a complete football player. Uh, I and mean, he taught me everything I know pretty much uh, as a ball uh, player. Uh, so he got me more more better and ready for the NFL, I feel like. So uh, he's a great coach, uh, a guy that people need to just uh, keep listening to. Uh, he's a vocal person. And it's just always a guy who is going to bring the best out you. Hey, heard uh, Coach Savage, one of the best guys in the world, man. He cares about his players. Um, first time he came in, bro, we met, ran like had mat drills and uh, ran the whole uh, stadium and uh, ran the whole uh, college campus. So I mean, he's just the guy who's going to bring it your best out. Uh, make sure you're ready at all times. Um, and um, it's showing, man. Just being able to have two double-digit uh, win seasons. Uh, he's got the program leading in the right way, him and Coach Mother.